Super fancy. All right. That's good. What's up, everybody? How you all doing? Welcome back Hello. to uh, Friday's stream. We're playing Gloomhaven. We're, still, we're getting started a little bit late. We had some technical difficulties. Uh, but we're at it now. So uh, we are doing uh, what is called the Noxious Cellar. Mm -hmm. um, this is a scenario that we unlocked because of Jacob's personal quest. Yes, I have revealed my quest that I am the Seeker of Zorn. Um, even as a child, you could feel the call of Zorn. Once worshipped as a god, his flock has long since been destroyed and disbanded. But you can hear him calling. You will travel to Gloomhaven as he commands... You'll find his remains and set him free. The plague will once again be embraced. Oh. You sound like a bad person. <laughs> no, what are you talking about? We'll see how this goes. Um, but yeah, so that's... playing a secretly evil character? What is this? <laughs> so that's what we're doing. You weren't uh, in that D&D &D group. <laughs> I played we'll one. We'll see... Uh, <laughs> oh yeah, you, you were there. We'll see sort of how it goes. Uh, but for now... Um, I think we're going to get started with this mission. Uh, it, it's a little bit weird, actually. This is sort of unconventional. So we've got these obstacles laid out through here. You can sort of see the boulders. Mm -hmm. um, those are unlike normal obstacles. They can't be destroyed. They can't be jumped over or flown over. And they can't be, uh, like, you can't range attack over them. So for all intents and purposes, the three of us are in three completely separate dungeons. William is here. Jacob is here, and I am here. I am squishy. This is not going right. to be a good so, thing. Yeah, like, I have a lot of abilities that are predicated on flanking. Jacob has a lot of, like, support abilities. William's fine. <laughs> um, this is my cup of tea. He's fine. Um, but, yeah, so this is going to be really interesting, really unconventional. Luckily, we don't have to kill all of the enemies. Mm -hmm. We just have to loot one treasure chest each. So we've got treasures here, here, and here at the far ends of each sort of corridor. Uh, and the objective is to loot one of those a piece uh, before we exhaust. So uh, we are going to be doing that. And uh, yeah, but first, let's talk about what we've been playing. <laughs> <laughs> wrong uh, wrong, wrong setting. Uh, let's do a city event. So we are still in the city of Gloomhaven. Uh, who wants to... William, would you like to pull it? Or Jacob? I'm going to make the other one of you do the road event. So. I'll pull the city. Whichever one has a voice, so I can do a mm -hmm. fantastic voice. Fantastic. All right. All right. You decide to head to the Brown Door for the evening to enjoy a quattro concert. Corruption and crime run rampant in the bar, but the music is unmatched in all of Gloomhaven. You are enjoying yourself immensely when you catch a glimpse of a man in a dark, tattered robe near the back of the room. He appears to be handing. Uh, handing bottles full of red liquid to a second man. Option A, further investigate the exchange between the men. Option B, leave the criminal element alone and continue to enjoy the show. B, man. I, I, I ain't gonna... I, gonna, I like, would lean B. Because, uh, uh, let's be honest, when they said you perceive, that was talking about one of you two. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, true enough. I'm not gonna try to interrupt somebody's uh, hustle. Sure. Let's go with B. Yeah. Um. Uh, not a bad choice. That's good. The that music is too good to be interrupted. You ignore the men in the back and simply have a great time. Gain one check mark each. Yeah, I know that. And shuffle right. this back into the deck. Nice. Ooh, okay, that's good. So the top one would have. Well, I, we don't know. What we don't know what the top. My first is. check mark. <laughs> I think yeah. over the course of the entire campaign, it's my second check mark. <laughs> I do not get check marks very often. Oh, I'm gonna this get a perk if I survive this. <laughs> do you not get it while we're in Gloomhaven? No, no, no. I mean, like, I need one more. Oh, okay. I'm, I'm still two away, and my thing doesn't have two checks. Mm -hmm. So, uh, okay, that was that was that. Mm -hmm. um, William, you already purchased pocket sand. Yep, pocket sand. Two gold discount. Jacob, I ain't you got, got shit for right. money. I've only got ten money as well, so no purchases for us. <laughs> uh, road event. Yeah. Bottle lag. Um, oh yeah, that's fine. That's why. Uh, this is all sound yeah. stuff. Oh, well, no, we're, we have sound going out. It's just that um, uh, I'm. Make, I'm trying to get like the uh, the oh, ambient uh, sounds and all that kind of stuff work. What you got? All right. 
The road contains many dangers, and chief among them are the barbaric tribes of the Ionox, that's racist, that inhabit the wilderness around the city. This is why your heart sinks when you see a mounted group of them ride up to you and surround your party. <coughs> ah! Agents of the wretched monstrosity, you call a town! The largest of the Ionox says as he looks down at you. Tell me, scum, what business do you have here out on my land? Have those fools sent you out to murder some more of my people? This actually plays well, considering yeah. we did. Yeah, that's, um, yeah. Mm. Option A, pretty deep. attempt yeah. to come to a peaceful resolution. Option B, attack the insulting, contemptuous Inox. I am torn, characterly. Peaceful. Here's the thing, right, is that I, if we wanted to politize, now's the time. You, we've got your, like... Hey man, like it's cool. Yeah. Uh, skills, because you are also an Inox, and I, as a scoundrel, would like to avoid face-to-face -face combat. Yeah. Right? Um, but I also recognize that you are ready to throw down all the time. Yeah. 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 So I. So assuming to, uh, you guys pull me back. Yeah. And we, we go do. with option B. Mm -hmm. Option B. Oh God. Oh no. Wait, no. It? Option B. Option B. Oh, wait. Uh, option A was the uh, peaceful. Yeah. yeah. That's yeah. Right. Okay. Yeah. okay. Good. Option good. A. Good. Okay. We, we, we didn't go and attack them in the face. Uh, <laughs> reputation. I'm always never good with these. What's it? Is it based on our current reputation? Yeah. Uh, so if our reputation is less than negative four. Which it is not. It is not. Okay, so otherwise. You try to explain that you mean the Ionox no ill will, but the leader eyes you skeptically. Foul creature, I curse you and your kind. Run and get off my land and never come back. All start scenario with curse. Does that apply to you as well? Yep. Yes, it does. Because that is not a scenario effect. Yeah. That mm -hmm. is a road effect. Also, this is a rip up. Mm -hmm. Literally, there was no good option with this. The best was a no effect. If we fought them, we start with three damage. Wow. That's a third of my Yes. Yeah. That's why I was very concerned. When I uh, saw that. So there we go. We prevented you from throwing down. We prevented you from fucking killing us all. Yeah. And this is a rip up, so. Yep. Yeah. The only way to avoid negative effects is to have negative four reputation. Yeah. I'm fine with just taking a curse. <laughs> yeah, pretty much. And I mean, now, you know, instead of having the two curses, I get the normal three curses that I've started like the last three fucking scenarios with. <laughs> I have a feeling this has to do with crypts and shit. <laughs> Might be. Like to avoid that in the future. I mean, I I found my crypts. <laughs> yeah, we don't have to do any more crypts. Except well, for the ones that might be part of this chain. chain. <laughs> sure. Uh, yeah. Okay, alright, so we've picked our starting locations. We have already dealt out our, our hands of cards. That's We're technically not supposed to do that yet, but we kind of do things out of order. Mm -hmm. um, Saves time. It makes us more active on the street. Exactly. It gives us more time for analysis paralysis later. So, uh, Pretty much. oh, I should read the thing. That's yeah, that would be important. a good idea. All right, here we go. So, Noxious Cellar. Wait. <laughs> Sorry. No, did, did we need to do a road event? Yeah. Yeah. No, because we're in the city of Gloomhaven. Shit. Well, we did one. We yeah, did we, one. I think we were already allowed, allowed to do one. Okay. Okay. So. We don't have to. Though. Okay, yeah, because I just realized, I was like, wait a minute. We didn't road anywhere. Yeah. <laughs> No, we. Yeah, I, also, when you'd like to think about this, literally some Inox warlord has taken over a neighborhood <laughs> in Gloomhaven, <laughs> is what this canonically means. True. I feel like we have to accept it because the card's ripped up. Yeah, I mean, in the case that players tr immediately travel to a new scenario, they must complete a road event before starting the new scenario, unless they are playing the same scenario, the new scenario is linked to the previous scenario, or they're in casual mode. <laughs> But it doesn't say anything about, like... We, oh. we read through the, the thing about Gloomhaven. There, there is a thing that the, uh, Gloomhaven is all considered to be... No, no, I know. What I mean to say is that there's nothing about yeah. whether you may choose okay. to take a road event, even sure. if you don't have to. So I'm going to assume that you can, and we did, and right. we got a curse. We didn't, we didn't just jackson build another card. Right. Um, okay, so, the Noxious Cellar. After skulking around... After skulking around in far more crypts than you'd like, you finally find a hint to the remains of Zorn in the ancient oh, sarcophagus, a tome with strange glyphs that glow in an eerie green hue. With some amount of study, you uncover an obscure passage in the text giving directions to an old shack in the sinking market. However, once you arrive at the house, you don't notice anything particularly interesting. 
Looking through the tome again, you see references to entering through an archway, but the building has nothing of the sort. That's when you see it. A set of long, flat stones in the dirt in front of the house fanned out radially to form a large circle. You wouldn't have thought much of it, but one of the stones is curved at the top like the apex of an archway. Inspecting it further, you notice a small switch and press it with curiosity. The stones sink into the ground, each one progressively farther until they form a circular staircase leading downward to the fully exposed archway. Mm -hmm. You descend the stairs and go through the entry into a round cellar without any other visible exit. You begin to search for more clues. You hear the grating of stone and look around to see the staircase slowly ascending back upward. In a panic, you renew your efforts to search the room. When you find an odd switch covered in glyphs, you press it in desperation. Immediately, the ground shakes and several massive boulders fall from the ceiling. Once the dust settles, you see you are alone, and the stone walls slide away to reveal doors and a host of unwelcoming enemies. At least the glyphs on the switch are in the same are the same tone you found in the right place. So, uh, we have some special rules. Uh, William got two curse cards. Uh, these Three. cannot be done, uh, blocked, or destroyed, or jumped over, or any of that bullshit in any way. Um, and the treasure tiles are special. You can't actually loot them using the standard just stand on top of the thing action. Mm -hmm. You have to loot them using the, uh, the, like an actual loot card or substitute a bottom action. Okay. So, uh, fucking let's get to it. Um, and we right. can adja a loot adjacently with the forfeit a bottom action. Thing. Correct. Okay. But only, that only applies to chests. You can't just do yeah, that yeah. with like a random effect yeah. throughout the entire time. Okay, I'm ready to go. Me too. Um, I got some typical things that I would yeah. do. Full of stupidity and full of... I've got some stuff too. Uh, I also have some stuff. All right. Ready? Let's go. 86. 20. 27. All right. Shaman moves at 9. Jesus. God damn uh, Scout moves at 35. Living corpses move at 32. Okay, so, okay, so shaman first. Shaman first. Uh, the shaman move and attack, uh, and then curse. So it uh, doesn't move because its range is optimal at the moment. Um, however, it is currently making a strength zero attack. So you're taking zero. You're taking negative one damage. And the curse. And a curse. You do take a curse. This is why I'm bolting to the door. Because I have, <laughs> you have five now. total moles yes. in this uh, deck. Alrighty. Uh, so now Jacob made 20. Yep. And then uh, 27. 27. Yeah, so Jacob's up. Alright, cool. Well, what I'm going to do is I'm going to go ahead and use my winged boots to make this movement here of four a jump. Okay. And go one, two, three, four. Open yon door. Right, open yon door. Uh, and hope I don't get fucked. You are slightly fucked. Yes. Um, so, two scouts, a shaman, and a jerk. Fun. Only the scout is elite. Alrighty. That means I have to put the drakes in. Yep. Actually, not that bad because you're only one person. Yeah. yeah. So it's a weak attack because it affects. But it poisons me. It does poison you, which is pretty shite. Right. Uh, okay. Do you have any movement left? No. Okay. Do you have an ability you want to use? Yes. Okay. I'm going to uh, place a trap. Noise. Right nice. there. Sport. Sun or stun or poison. Uh, six damage. Oh shit. Okay. Hell yeah. Yep. Yeah. And that avoids shield, right? Yeah. Yeah. Let's go. Let's just kill that right? uh, Okay. So. No, 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 no. Cool. Oh yeah. yeah, yeah. It is. Uh, next up, you reveal a it. new shaman. So that shaman moves. And um, gives you another curse card. And gives you a curse card and deals you no damage. Clayton's Ewok looking like. Alright. 
So. Um. Okay. That is Jacob's turn. Okay. That is my turn. Twenty-seven. Twenty-seven. So I'm gonna use jump. Go one, two, three. So technically the door opens before open I end my movement. I have to put oozes now. <laughs> Fucking all of the things. <laughs> oh. <laughs> oh uh, and Jacob, can you deal out help for the? Yeah, yeah, I'll deal that. Oh, they don't look fun. We have enough. We don't, we're not going to have enough health tokens. We don't have enough health tokens. Uh, that may, means they don't spawn. We may have to count up. Yeah, we're going to have to count up this time. We can count down on the ones who've already placed. No, because we're oh. going to. We, we need the singles. We're, we literally yeah. have no oh. more single, okay. singles. Okay. Yeah, we'll just count. So. Uh, yeah, Daimyo, we are, uh... We're trying out we're some new... playing around with some sounds. We got, tech. we got, like, the music, and then we've got the... Oh, yeah, duh, I should have been doing this. Because I've got the Sound. door. Oh, yeah. <laughs> so, we got, some, we got some fun stuff. Yeah, but only three enemies total. Yeah. And no dragon. Mm-hmm. And yeah. Dragon. You got the you got the ooze. I'm trying to see if I should be using my extra movement right now. Well not quite. Ooze moves at eighty five. So very, very late. What is it do you want? Uh push and poison adjacent enemies. Ooh. Then make an attack. So it doesn't move though, you're fine. Mm-hmm. Okay. It doesn't move? It does not move. Okay, then I'll use my extra movement to go to. Oh, one, two. Cool. Uh, um, and then I have an uh, attack with range three, which means I may not. Uh, that's you can't hit anything. Yeah, so I'm gonna not actually use my boots or striding. Okay. Uh, untap them. Yeah, untap that. And uh, spare dagger. I don't have line of sight on this guy necessarily, do I? Actually, I can mm. fix this. Yeah, or you can just end it. Yeah, there. there we go. Then I will spare dagger him. Okay. Um, uh, I think technically you would have, because you can draw from here to here. Okay. So I don't know. It's up to you. Really matters. Okay. Well, if you're not if you're not going to use jump the next time, you want to be. Here. I will be. Okay. <laughs> uh, okay. So spare dagger that shit. Um, yeah. So spare dagger. Plus your three damage. Okay. Three. Damage. Not a null. Holy shit. First the first attack and not a null. Boom. <laughs> one shot. One kill. One shot. One killing. One shot. Just in case. As I proceed to kill. All right. As, what is it? As I proceed to miss five headshots in a row. Okay. And uh, I'm then going to burn my stamina potion to take back this card into my hand. Makes sense. All right. Um. Yep. Next is the living corpses. Yep. They don't move. They mm, just attack. Yeah. Okay. And they suffer one damage each. Oh, perfect. Cool. Wow. That's. Fantastic. Fortuitous. So number one, number three, number four, and six. And number six. Second one damage each. Good job, guys. <laughs> Yay. And then the Vermling Scouts. You the real MVP. Uh, yes, the Vermling Scouts. Move that one goes first. Jump with jump. And they loot. Oh, so motherfuckers jump? Uh, well, specifically this action allows them to jump. Normally they don't. I know, but I was just thinking of that. So, let's see, number six moves, uh, no, yeah, uh, six is low, mm -hmm. that's unusual, uh, four, five, so one, two, three, four, four actually, I, I, we have a sound effect board, that's, that's literally right there, what we've got, let's say he jumps, uh, and if he attacks, we've got some swords, ah, yeah, 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 I know how that is. I, I, I watch that a lot. <laughs> I think this guy jumps and then actually moves around the obstacles. Mm -hmm. yeah. Or whichever. Yeah. Or having it. That is funny. Okay. Uh, and then uh, this guy here. Oh, they don't attack? No. Oh, wow. 
Losers. Yeah. I mean, <laughs> sorry, sorry, sorry. Oh, wait, yeah. hang on, hang on, hang on, hang on. And then there's nowhere else for this guy to go. Okay. So, so he does have to go here. So he dies. I get two experience. I was gonna be like, damn it, <laughs> my my like trap, and that was completely useless. <laughs> uh, um, mm, <laughs> yeah, it's it's a little tough for you right now. Yeah, I'm not looking at it right now. Can you recover your discarded card and get a jump ready? Or that's no, not, that was a. Uh, that's an item. That's that a long rest. rest. Is it a long rest? Yeah. Uh, okay, alright. So that. And I hate long rest in here. <laughs> I believe that is all the scouts. I believe that that is true. So then it's. Fortunately, the scouts are set. Ooze doesn't Ow. move, it just sort of like. Yeah. Uh, and then it's me. Yeah, we don't have a sound effect for that. <laughs> we don't have a sound effect for. <laughs> <laughs> there is a uh, ooze I know, I, uh, thing I, I, actually on the parrot. Yeah. Uh, okay, so I'm going to activate uh, Single Out, which is a persistent effect. My next four attacks targeting enemies that are not adjacent to any of their allies gain plus two attack. This doesn't. This isn't going to apply this turn, but that's okay. I'm going to Venom Shiv. So this is a strength three attack. Uh, this guy is dead. I like that the Vermlings have, like, no health. <laughs> that is nice. Let's see. Which one has shields? The shaman. Uh, yes, the shaman has shields. Uh, the ooze also has tiny amounts of shields, but you're not actually going to do that. Mm -hmm. um, okay, and then last but not least is the spitting drakes. Yep. Drake, singular. Uh, so it moves to. One, two, and makes an AoE attack at minus two range. It can't actually reach you. Awesome. That's what I like to do. Uh, yeah, because it the, the closest, the furthest it can reach with its attack is right here, mm -hmm. and even with the AoE, it still isn't going to reach you. So you're fine. Cool. Uh, and that's the only Drake. Yeah, no, no worries. I mean, we're, we're still playing around with this, and we're trying to figure out, like... You know, well, like, we're we're trying, in particular, yeah. to calibrate the levels. Like, because yeah. I worry about them being too loud, but I think sometimes they're also too cold. Or too well, well, also, we're not, we're not, we're not, uh, it's not really through there that we're capturing them. It's actually capturing the audio from the computer. Oh! Oh, well, then fuck it. Yeah. You're gonna tell me that. Yeah. <laughs> uh, okay. Like, that's for us to hear that it's something so, going on. this shuffles, this shuffles. Mm -hmm. And we start the next round. Oh god, what the hell am I gonna do? I know. Let's start out, they. Hey! I think I'm gonna do this. That one. Don't know what that is, but I support you unconditionally. Cool. Oh shit, uh, this guy moved. One, two, three. He moved here, and then he can't actually curse you. Because you're too far away. Yeah, Wait, yeah, yeah. On. One, two, three. Yeah, you can't curse. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It'd be great if you made that noise and then realized <laughs> that he could curse you. <laughs> That's you what I'm afraid of. <laughs> okay. Um. Yep. I'm good. I'll use that. <laughs> cool. Going somewhere in the middle. Middle. Uh, considering it doesn't necessarily affect us all, yeah. I'm just gonna do it whenever. Cool. You'll never know. You'll never know. If any of you guys need fire. Oh yeah, that's true. I did I, generate wind. I basically down. don't interact with elements yeah. at all. I don't think any of us do really. Uh, not this time. I don't have the card that would have used wind. <laughs> right, I honestly think if push came to shove, I could probably solo my room. I mean, I think I would have to get some lucky draws, but. 
think I'm going to have to sell them. Sell them. I oh, well, uh, uh, oh, yeah. yeah. <laughs> I don't really have much of a choice. Yeah. Oh, you'll be generating fire, huh? I wonder why. <laughs> uh. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> you never guessed why. Yeah, you, 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 don't, you don't know what's going to happen. <laughs> All right, here we go. This Absolutely not, not oh, a that's a, that's a sound effect that I should, we should have added. Yeah. Fire. <laughs> yeah. Uh, all right, 10. 10? 47. All right, Shaman 61. at 89. Scout at 29. Living Corpse at 71. Ooze at 66. And Spitting Drake at 89 again. What's he doing? Uh, so minus one. you or one. I, what's your secondary? No, okay, secondary. so I go first. Um, so I will... Use throwing same knives. Oh, yeah, the same thing. Yeah. Uh, it was throwing knives to make two two strength attacks at these guys. Alright. Um, starting with number three. Two damage. And then on to number six. Four damage. You can see it. There's no, like, blind throw grenade <laughs> in this game, right? There isn't. Okay. So uh, I can just, then... like, hurl something over the rocks. <laughs> and just demolish. Nope. Uh, okay, so I gain experience. Take care of some of your baddies. <laughs> um, and then <laughs> I will use Swift Bow to move two spaces, looting every hex that I pass through. Nice. Okay. And I'm done. Cool. Okay. With my ten, I'm yeah. going to attack and disarm. To number six. So, pshaw, three damage. Okay. On to number this one here. Yeah, number six. Three damage, you said? Three damage, and he is disarmed. Okay. He cut off his arms. <laughs> Disarmed. Well, he's 60% of the way dead. Yep. Yeah. And then okay. I'm going to move three. One, two, okay. let's hear One, two, three. Uh, next up, what are you at? I'm at 40, 40. 47. Okay, so then it's scouts. 29, the scouts. So yep. we have 6, 8, and 10 in play. 6 goes first. Mm -hmm. 6 can't make an attack. So 6 just moves 1, 2. Mm -hmm. Lose 8. Uh, 8 wants to make a ranged attack. Mm -hmm. So 8 goes 1, 2. Mm hmm and shoots a bow at you, Jacob, for yep. one strength, mm -hmm. two strength. Okay. That's a good card to use a crit on. Yeah, right. exactly. exactly. <laughs> that um, is a nice waste of And then 10 does the same. Uh, one damage, one damage. Not bad. Not bad at all. Not bad at all. Uh, okay, so that's them at 29, and then, oh no, sorry, the non-elites. Uh, this one here doesn't have to move at all. Mm -hmm. um, yeah, exactly. Oh shit, hang on. I was looking at the, the non elite stat block. You actually took four and then two damage. Oui. So an extra, so I took two and then one, so. Uh, Another three damage. Three damage? Yeah. That's painful. Uh, okay, and now this one is making an attack against you. Mm -hmm. One. Just remember, losing cards is absolutely your friend in this one. I know. Uh, okay, so now that's all the scouts. Can you discard uh, a card to lose the negative effect of a trap? Trav Hunter, hello, hello. What's going on, buddy? How are you doing? Uh, yes, any incoming source of damage can okay. be negated with uh, by uh, Just losing cards. something that some of the more desperate of us might need. Yep. Uh, okay. Naming me. And then it's you. <laughs> Not naming any names. 47, you're up. Really annoying. They moved away from me. Yeah. I was not happy about that. So I'm moving here. Um. So I was going to get a, a bonus of plus one to my attack, but now I can't. Mm -hmm. And then I'm going to flamethrower the shit out. Yeah. Um. I think what I'm going to do. Uh, to well, welcome. Fun. We're very happy to have you. Uh, hopefully, seeing it is uh, everything that you expected. I mean, I'm sure it's. Yeah. Not quite as good as playing it, but, uh, you know, we try to keep it entertaining. Yeah. Uh, we are currently uh, doing a mission called the Noxious Cellar, 
which is a little bit unconventional. So normally we would be fighting enemies and we would be talking between us about, okay, I'm going to use, like, I'm going to try to do this type of thing because there's limited communication. So we can't just go to say, I'm going to use this ability at this initiative. We have to say, like, I'm going to try to go early in the round and take care of these guys over here. So normally that's what we'd be doing. But this particular mission has us um, completely blocked off. So we can't interact with each other and we can't interact with the enemies in each other's areas either. So uh, it's, it's a little bit different in that way, and at this point we're just trying to uh, stabilize. Damn it. Oh man, Tabletop Live. Yeah. Um, the like It's a great game, and any chance that you can take to, uh, to see it played, or to play it yourself, um, I think is, is a lot of fun. I think it's got a lot going for it in terms of like, game, like, design compared to other dungeon crawlers. So, right. so what I just did... Yeah, what, what's up? What do we got? Um, I just, I used my uh, eagle eye goggles yeah. on this. Um, and I did four damage to each of these two, nice. uh, two dudes. So both and die. wounded. Yes, they're both, both of them are dying on their next turn. Uh, fire has been uh, strengthened. And... I get two experience. Also, I'm getting that treasure chest on my next turn. Okay. Um, cool. And that's all she wrote, except I am also going to use my minor stamina potion to take back... Stamina potion's coming handy. Yeah. I'm going to take back, let's see, I think... These guys into my hand. Um, all right. Yep, that's, that's okay. what I got. So next up is the ooze at 66. Uh, it moves. It doesn't move. <laughs> it moves? It, it no. moves minus one, and its speed is one. All so right. it doesn't move at all, and it heals yep. itself for two, but it's already at four. Uh, next up is the living corpses at 71. Okay. So starting with number one, they move one, one space. <laughs> and then number three doesn't move at all and makes a strength four attack against me. I don't like that okay. one, but uh, I'm going to give it disadvantage. Cool. Oh, these are supposed to shuffle. No, that was this Oh, that was this, that was this yeah. round. Because you got critted on. Yes, I did. I forgot about that. That's why I set it aside. Yeah. So that we don't forget. Uh, okay, so attacking with disadvantage. Bam. Bam. I'll take the minus one. So. Three damage. Three damage on you. More than I would like, but less than I could have been. Mm -hmm. And I am poisoned. That's even worse. That is rough, yes. Yeah. Um, and then, so that's number three. Number four goes here, and number six goes here. And then Sean. Uh, or Drake. No. Uh, yeah. So we can we can decide. Uh, doesn't really matter. Uh, technically, the Drake should go first if they can attack because the Shaman bless. And we don't want that. Good thinking. Good thinking. All right. So the Drake moves two spaces. One, two. Although and I think they only bless themselves. Once again, fails to attack you. Wow, that's <laughs> useful. So, uh, oh, I, love yeah. when they, I love when they fail to attack me. Uh, that makes and me then happy. the Shaman moves. Well, okay. So hang on. We have multiple Shaman. Mm -hmm. We've got three, five, and nine. So this shaman moves here. Heals. Oh, we've also guy. got a shaman there. Yeah. That's, oh. Oh number no, that's one. one. I was looking at this guy. No. Uh, okay. So number one moves first. Mm -hmm. He moves here. Oh no. Yep. He heals. Oh. This guy for one. Oh. Oh man. Which removes the wound. And it, then, it doesn't heal and it, it, it does. does poison. Poison. Oh! Uh, and then yeah. blesses. Yeah. Pretty much. And then blesses the, uh, the which one was it, deck? Mm -hmm. Yeah, that one. And then this guy moves here and heals and blesses. Could I get more bless cards, please? Uh, yes. Two. And then this guy moves here and blesses. Uh, and that is all she mm -hmm. wrote. Alrighty. Alrighty. I'm good to go. I'm getting the treasure chest this turn. I am not happy. 
Not a happy camp. No, I don't imagine. <laughs> this is not a good thing for me. Yeah. Alright, I'm going to try to do this, and then I'm also going to do... The good news is that the two elites are almost dead. Nice. You can focus single target on the one elite who got healed. Da, 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 da. Okay, the corpse won't be a factor. This and I think I'm going to do this. I think. Yeah. All right. Cool. I think I got my turn figured out. But I think that before uh, we go on, because we got some people on right now. Oh Ooh, yeah. Um, Ooh yeah. Cake. Cake. So I feel like it's uh, a victory cake. We have a really, really cool cake, which was made for us by actually one of our viewers who's in the chat room right now, Eric hey. Ramsey. Um, so thank you very much. Thanks, uh, Amanda, right, for sweet. making the, the cake. The best, the literal <laughs> best, and I can't wait to meet you. And, every, like, and I say that in the least creepy way possible. <laughs> um, and yeah, you can check out uh, more of her uh, actual cakes and all that at... Um, let me make sure I'm saying this right. Amandine uh, uh, Sugar Art, and she's on Instagram. She's on uh, a lot of that. So yep, there, there she is. <laughs> so thank you very much. Uh, and I right. think we're gonna cut into that because uh, <laughs> yeah. And so every time that we get a slice, we get a bless card, right? That's the rule. Yeah. Totally. Yeah. Yeah. yeah that, that, uh, that's how it works. Right? <laughs> In link is in chat. Yeah, there you go. Link to the, the cakes and the big words is in chat. So check it out. Uh, We're hugely grateful. I yes. can't wait to put this in my face. It's going to be really... This uh, episode is sponsored by cake. It's going to be really unseen. Really, is what it's going to be. Um, oh, uh, I have to shuffle this. Oh, I'm so happy. I can literally get to this chest and activate this turn. Good. And then it's just skull bashing the rest of the time. Alrighty. I am going to cut into this. How do you think? Cut through the dragon? Cut the dragon's head off. In a way that doesn't ruin the radial You could probably have cake. a slice that's just a... Well, not I'm going to do it like this. There you go. Yeah. There you go. Oh, that's a sex line cut. <laughs> oh, that's nice. Alright, I'm going to just cut all the way through. Please uh, forgive this temporary. <laughs> <laughs> Forgive this uh, cake break. <laughs> oh, hello! <laughs> comes out of the woodwork is like, I heard there was cake. Uh, I heard there was a cake break. Yes. Yes. I like it right now. Alrighty. It's perfect cutting on stream, too. You can see yeah. the cut. Yeah. yeah. Nice. <laughs> Yeah, we have a mind for cinematography here. Exactly. Have you guys selected your actions? Yep. Yep. Cool. All right. I'm at 23. I'm at 54. <laughs> Harrison has selected I know exactly what I'll do. He's, he's doing the action called eat. <laughs> <laughs> uh, all right, so. Who's, what the shit? You can grab your. What? Oh, God. The ooze gets to split. Hmm. Oh, God. <laughs> Have fun. I mean, it's fine. I will complete my objective. This Holy turn. shit! That looks great. No, no, no. <laughs> Come here. Come here. <laughs> Look at that. Look at that. Oh, Yo, you can't see it because it's too dark. But there's like fruit studded in there. Like, oh. yeah. <laughs> Thank you. Uh, did I flip over everybody? I did flip over everybody. They the good one of the like our saving graces here is that they do move relatively slowly. Holy shit! Yeah. Uh, do I go before? There's four right here, Harrison. Uh, uh, you get yeah, to choose. Yes. Okay. Then, yeah. The answer is yes. I will be able to move out of the range of the scout loser. Ooh, scout applies poison. Oh, that's gonna be fun. Yeah, these enemies are very flexible with their tactics, and I don't like it. <laughs> All right. Ooh. Is that raspberry looks like? Yeah, chocolate raspberry. Oh, man. <laughs> mm. made, with, <laughs> made with real raspberry. Yes. Yes, I, I agree, mm. uh, uh, Damio. I totally so agree. Good. Right? Yes, mad props from the, uh, the Great British Bake Off <laughs> watching folks in the audience tonight. Yeah. <laughs> 
This is delicious. It's so moist. Yeah. It's also it's also soaked with raspberry liqueur. Ah, uh, okay. Yeah. So a lot of good stuff in here. All right. Everybody ready? Liqueur, Jacob. This is the drunkest you've ever gotten. <laughs> <laughs> mm-hmm. All right. What's everybody's initiative? Uh, fifty-four. Thirty-four. Twenty-three. I'm up. I'm gonna push through this door. Disarm this trap. Good. And now I have to spawn my own enemies, <laughs> which is an elite. Is this there an asshole. ooze? No, there's not an ooze. There's only one ooze. Uh, oh, there's two oozes in the wing that we're not actually using. Mm. Exactly. Two. Yep. Slosh board game string. <laughs> yeah. It's not like we haven't done that in the past. <laughs> well, slosh board gaming. Yeah. I don't sure. think we've ever streamed well. Well, not well slosh, but we we, yeah. we do drink on stream every once in a while. We do. There was that time when Isaac was around and they had that whole growler. <laughs> <laughs> that was a good day. And they got a beer in a fantasy football draft a while ago. And we, we, I mean, we, we, we had, um, you had some beer on, um, what's it? Seafall. Yeah, Seafall. It was very salty. Mm-hmm. Um, very good, though. Sequin mm-hmm. ale. If you're, uh, if you're a fan of sour ale, can't go wrong. Yep. All right. So. All right, that's me. That's you. I'm done. Who's next? Me? Uh, you. Cool. 34 you. is second fastest. Yeah, that's impressive. But that's very good because I think I'm going to be able to kill both of these fucks. That's good. But shit. Ah, I'm going to take this advantage. <laughs> No, that's very annoying. On my turn, I'm going to use my minor stamina potion to regain Venom Shiv. And. I'm going to move there instead so I don't take this advantage. And now I hit both of these guys with an attack at strength 2. So the first one is number 8, gets 2 damage. Number 8 is dead. Nice. That. Um, coin. Goes right there, and then a number ten takes crit. four damage. Crit, Boom. and he is uh, crit kick. Fucked. <laughs> Obliterated. Long story short, she has been destroyed. Um, so there's that, and there's that, and yeah, I think uh, that's my turn. Boom. Oh, shoot. I forgot to, speaking of killing. Yeah. All right. Okay. Not just that. Kaylee. I uh, still go before. You still though. go before everybody. Okay. So with my stuff, I'm going to move three while jumping. Mm-hmm. And I am going to activate my boots of striding to go a one, a two, a, a three, two, three, four, a four, a five. End my turn there. Mm-hmm. And then I'm going to ha, ha, ha. Pop my loot. I'm sorry. What just <laughs> happened to your brain? <laughs> I'm gonna pop my loot to loot this treasure chest. Isn't it everything within one around you? Yup. So Which means two coins. You motherfucker! You get the coins too. <laughs> <laughs> I completed my objective. I was gonna get those coins even if it wasn't. There you go. Uh, so I just. I mean, I already like, completed my I, objective too. This so. is just done. Yeah. No you just special text or anything. Special okay. We have to wait to get special text. Yep. Yeah. Okay. So now well, that's my turn. There you go. Hmm. So starting with, could we actually? Yes. I will move this over. Uh, as gorgeous as it is, <laughs> we, uh, I need space. Yes. True. All right. Um, turn it around so that way they can get half the cake oh, yes. shot. <laughs> Ooh. So this guy is going to move here. Oh, Wait, he doesn't have to move at all. Fuck my talk. Um, he's not going to move at all. He's just going to make a strength three attack against me. Mm-hmm. I don't like that at all. <laughs> oh, I'm. Nope. No. 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 Get, well, hang on, actually. I'm going to just... Hmm. 
I'm just gonna lose Thieves, Knack, and Swift, though. Because that might, like, the things that I would lose from my hand are the two that I just recovered that are gonna yeah. enable me to get to the treasure chest next turn, mm -hmm. the thing that prevents me from taking damage, the thing that turns me invisible so that I don't take damage, and the thing that heals me. So <laughs> I'm not losing any of that shit. Yeah, totally. Um, but this is a blessed, which means it's gone. Mm hmm. So that's nice. Uh, so yeah. that was this guy. And then this guy moves one, two, and can't make an attack. Okay. This guy. Yep. This guy here. He can make an attack from right where he is. Yep. It's strength two. Okay. Jacob, you take three damage and are poisoned. Yeah, I am not taking the three damage. <laughs> well, you're still going to be poisoned. I know. I'm oh, sorry. wait, you still get poisoned here in the death card? Yep. Yeah, I'm Oh, that's gonna Effects are applied regardless of the damage dealt. That, that's why. Yeah, I, to be fair, that applies to them as well as us. Yep. But we have used that to great Indeed. effect in the past. Alright. Which one of these do I want? This so part, I've already got my next hand turned out. It's just kill time. Mm, not you, not you. And the best thing is, angle I'm mm. at right now, no flying enemies. Literally, I can just kite them. Uh, this guy moved, yes, yes, he moved. <laughs> or not kite, kill box, kill box them. <laughs> you're too useful. Yeah, you're the least useful, surprisingly enough. You okay. good? Yeah. All right. Uh, spinning drakes move, so five, six, and four, so yep. four moves first. Yep. Uh, they move three spaces and make an attack at range two. So it probably moves to here. Yep. Uh, that makes absolute a worst. two attack. <laughs> you just can't get by there. No. Uh, you take two damage and are muddled. Take three damage. Because that poison. Yes, yeah. three damage. Oh, wait, poison doesn't apply in the same round. It's attack, right? No, it does. No, it does. Oh, it does. It's elements. Can't be yeah. consumed in the same round they're yeah. generated. Well, I am also getting rid of this. And also getting muddled. This is not looking very good for me. Okay, Jacob, keep your burst of movement. What burst of movement? <laughs> um, oh okay, so that's that worm. Then this worm moves here and makes an attack against me. Strength two, plus one because I'm poisoned. Four, I... Refuse. <laughs> I refuse! Um, I'm going to give up my heal, because at this point I don't think the game is going to last that long. Um, Whichever way it goes. And this guy moves one, two, three, and makes an attack against me. Strength three, four, I'm muddled. I mean, I was muddled previously as well. But, um... I am just going to take the damage. Hmm. I'm at two health. Oi! Oi! Right. Right. Okay, so oh, that is Shitting Drakes. Next is Shamans. So, Shamans, let's see, we've got an. There are no elites, so that means we've got regular one, three, and five. Um, they have a ranged attack, which means this one can make an attack without moving. So, strength two, two. Wait, am I... Two to you. Two to you. Two plus one, because of your poison. So, three incoming damage. Motherfucker. Poison fucking sucks. Yeah. Is this what we've been doing to people? I, <laughs> we deserve to be in here. <laughs> I'm running out of cards to get rid of. <laughs> Same. Oh man. Uh, no, I can't I have to do one of these. Mm. Mm. I definitely think next Sorry, turn I should take one of yours if we have to do this again. Technically, uh, that, I couldn't have had that in my hand. I forgot. Oh, because it had yeah. was supposed to have been lost? Yeah, so I was supposed to have this in my hand and. Um, Things are not looking good for uh, the adventuring party of the long, short, and medium of it. It's not looking good for the long and medium of it. Yeah. That's true. The short is 
Although no, I am the short. Yeah. Well, no, it's not short. looking good it's for the medium and short of it. Yeah. I mean, I'll be fine. I have jump. Like this is yeah. this is the biggest problem that Jacob is facing right now is that he can't actually move through these to just clear the enemies. Yeah. Mm-hmm. All right. Okay. That's it. Okay. Uh, next up is this shaman who just moves. He can't move. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. And then this shaman who moves here and attacks. Bring it. So. Strength. Oh, hang on. Jacob, you took one less damage. Doesn't matter. Cool. I, uh, I lost the card anyway. So. a proper <laughs> crit. What's it, what do I take? You're currently taking four damage. Oh no! That's right, four damage. Okay. First, so that is suffered. the shaman. Next is the living corpses. Who, let's see. One, two. One, two. One, two. One, two. They suffer one damage piece. Okay. Hmm. Okay. Uh, and then last but not least, the ooze. The ooze suffers two damage. Okay. This is number nine. Summon a normal ooze with a hit point value equal to the summoning ooze's current hit point value, limited by the normal ooze's specified maximum hit point value. So, it's a- so it summons a seven hit point normal ooze. Bring it! All right. Shoot. I mean... You're fine. <laughs> yeah, no, I'm perfect. Uh, okay, so that is the enemies. This gets shuffled. This gets shuffled. This gets shuffled. This gets shuffled. All right. Let's see. Will I survive? Yeah, this is a very good question. Now to go offensive or defensive is the question. How much damage do the traps do? You just pop down traps in front of you. That's not gonna help me. Oh, four. Oh, those traps. Four? Yeah. Mother of God. Five with the No, the poison oh. doesn't affect, uh, doesn't affect traps. Correct. Okay. Um Alright. Run, Jacob, run! Uh, I don't... I can't. <laughs> I can't. <laughs> um. Mm-hmm. Do you have... Do, I keep forgetting. Do you have the ability to regain all your lost cards? No, he can cause us to regain our lost cards. Oh. The Elementalist has the ability to yep. regain her own lost cards. Shit. Um, Agreed. So you can tank any source of damage. It doesn't have to be attack damage by discarding mm-hmm. cards. So your best bet may just be blitz it. I mean, I don't know how yeah. fast you can move. I can, I can only, uh, I can only move up to four. Uh, yeah, that means you're still basically right in the middle of them. Exactly. Yeah, I'm just sort of in a rough position. Come on, Jesus. So I guess the question is. You. No, I have to do that. Okay. I'm going to use this. And then. Characters who live get to keep the experience they gain? Use this. Even if they, the scenario is lost? Yes, I believe so. I think that's pretty. If I remember correctly from the last time that I survived. Okay. I'm going to pop all of my experience gaining things right now. Okay. Finishing a scenario. Success or failure tally the experience your character's earned and take money tokens your character's needed. Sounds good. You only you only get check marks if you successfully complete the scenario. Okay. okay. I don't go check marks anyways. All right. <laughs> yeah. All right. Uh, oh shit! Hang on. Great. Hmm. Damn it! A muddled. That's fine. It's gonna suck, but it's fine. Are your created traps lose after using? Mm-hmm. Mo- yeah. Most of my cards are lose after oh, using. 
my flamethrower, my like everything is all lose after you. Twelve points. Nineteen. All right. Shaman at sixty-two. Scouts at sixty-nine. Living corpse at eighty-two. Spitting Drake at thirty-two. Ooze at fifty-nine. I'm so all go before the. the I'm glad that I made the adjustment that I did because otherwise I'd probably die to Living Drake's. All right. All right. So, so uh, twelve. I think mm-hmm. he's fast. Yeah. All right. I'm going. I'm invisible. I. That's happening. <laughs> yep. Jesus Christ. I'm invisible. On my next attack, while invisible, double the value of that attack, and dark is strong. I mean, dark is strong now. And, yeah. Um, and then I will use Venom Shiv in conjunction with Winged Shoes uh, to move one, two, three, four. Nice. Thank you. Alright. Uh, and then that is the entirety of this stuff. Uh, whichever of you is next. 19. You're probably, yeah, 27. Alright. One, two, three, four. I take, well, I don't take the four damage. I discard for the four for the damage. Right. Um, but... And then I'm going to attack these guys with this um, to immobilize them. Pretty mm-hmm. much. Nice. Yep. Uh, I don't know if that's actually. Or actually, uh, what have we got coming up? The both the Drake and the Shaman are within range to hit you at the moment. Uh, so it doesn't matter. Yeah. I do those. Well, the, the scout is right next to me, so it doesn't matter. Oh, is he doing a range attack to scout? No. That's fine. Well, I'm fucked. Okay. Uh, I'm going to use the piercing bow, just because I'm doing it with uh, at the shaman. Yeah, shit, try to kill it. Um, so, that means I've got... Let's see. Um, now, let's go Drake first. Alright, Drake first. Plus one and wound. So, Excellent. four damage and he's wounded and immobilized. I also gain two what experience. Number, three is that? Uh, number four. And then the shaman. Yep. Number one is uh, takes six damage. Nice. It's dead. And yeah, no shields. It's dead. Nice. Well done. You may have bought that, yourself enough yeah. time. I may have survived. <laughs> we'll see. Especially the staving off. I mean, I think, honestly, a big part of it has to do with how many cards you have that you can't afford to lose. Yep. Like, I think we're all sort of in that mode right now. Um, does short rest happens at the end of the turn? Uh, end of your turn? Short or? rest happens at the end of the round. Okay. That's fine. Uh, okay, and now it's William. Okay. Uh, so I will attack three, range three, on two. Uh, this is Sean, right? That's no. correct. Uh, he's got three shields. Don't want to do that. I'll uh, attack them to the normal ooze. Okay. Oh, so, uh, attack, minus yep. one. That was stupid. Minus one, so it takes one damage. Yep. Great. Um, and that's one experience point, and for this, I will activate this, which is on the next six sources of damage. You gain shield one. So, yippee. Yep. You've got it. <laughs> All right. All right. So next up is them. The spitting drakes move first at thirty-two. Okay. Your spitting drake doesn't, doesn't move because it doesn't have to, so it makes well, a strength and two. And it's also immobilized. It's also immobilized. And it takes, I takes one damage. So I'm gonna get this shit out of the way. It's at five. It's got three health remaining. Okay. Right. That's good. Uh, so strength two. Mm-hmm. One. Not bad. Except that does two damage to me. Oh, because the poison. Uh, so ball breaking. I'm going to take it because I, I need to. You need to be carefully calibrated. Yes. Okay. Uh, I mean, if you can afford to take the hits, I think this is the point where you just take them. Mm-hmm. Um, the ooze. Uh, the Actually, oozes don't no. get to move. Fuck. So, uh, William. Yes. You are taking a strength two attack. They have range. They do. Uh, no, oh. sorry, you're taking a strength three attack from the elite boost. Mother coverage. So, strength three, six. Gain one shield! So you 
take five and are poisoned. And are poisoned? And are poisoned. Oh. Yep. Okay. Uh, it's like poison he took. And then two incoming damage. So two, three incoming damage from the ooze. Two damage. Bumped up to three? Or just... No, that's after factoring in poison. Okay. At one health now. Okay, so that's the oozes. Next up is the shaman. So uh, that shaman's dead. Yes. This shaman moves one, two. This shaman doesn't move at all and makes a strength one attack against William. William, you've got one plus one for poison is two, minus one is one. It's a one damage attack? One damage attack. He has one shield, does he? I have one shield. Yes, you do. Shield. So nothing. Oh, and did you remember to reduce it from the uh, yeah, previous So I have two health, technically. Um, yeah, you're right. Yeah, because I, I used it once, twice. Mm-hmm. Now I've used it three times. Yes, okay. yes, that's great. So, okay. I want experience for that. I'm at two health, guys. Yay! Uh, scouts are next at six. Mm-hmm. Uh, scout. This one moves first. Uh, and it goes one, two, three. And then this one goes. Mm-hmm. And it doesn't move at all, and stabs you for three, plus one for poison, it's four, four. Okay, that just means that I lose a card. Right, exactly, at this point, like, that's what that means. Uh, and the living corpses are, oh, this is living corpse, actually. No, living corpses don't move at all, because they have, uh, move minus one. Cool. All right, end of the round. All right. Shuffle, 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 do you have... Or no, no, sorry, sorry. Three out of four chance of not screwing. Oh, that's you. Cool. That's you. But if I'm screwed, I'm completely screwed. Next year. Not my five movement. Okay. Good. Or four movement. That, I needed my four movement. Uh, if you're blitzing, make sure you move first. Like... Play your lowest initiative cards so you can move before the scout. There's only so much I can do with that. Right. Okay. Uh, oh, and I'm no longer muddled, but I am invisible. Still. All right. That's all I can do with that. All right. Yeah, pretty good. Going to be good. Yes. Cool. Cool. Nine. Fifteen. Er, eighteen, sorry. Thirty-four. Twenty-three for the shaman. Forty for the scout. Okay. Uh, li- Sixty-six for the living corpse. Oh, it wouldn't have blocked you anyway, because it doesn't have to move to attack. Uh, the ooze is going to separate again. Oh, no, they're, oh, they're both going to separate. <laughs> question. Here's, here's, my, here's my question, though. Oh, no, they're going to move there. They're going to move. All right. Uh, nine is probably first. So mm-hmm. I'm going to use quick hands to move here and just get this at the end of the turn for standing up. And then I'm going to use Trickster's Reversal to uh, ignore this and instead loot this chest. Okay. All mm-hmm. of my cards. I am also no longer invisible, which frankly blows. Yep. All right, this comes down to me. Can I get there? <laughs> and that's exactly what it comes down to. What's your speed? Uh, 18. You're up. Okay. Um, so I'm actually learning about this now. I'm going to use this to, because no one's going to attack me, really. So here's my question. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Move to attack to. Mm-hmm. Can he spawn a noose? No. No. Wait. Hang on. <laughs> Summon. Wait, hang on. No. I'm looking for enemy summon. Yep. Summon. Monster <laughs> summon abilities placing new monsters are being able to be summon monsters are placed in an empty hex adjacent to the summoning monster and also as close to the enemy as possible. If there are no summoned, uh, no empty adjacent hexes or there are no available standees, the summon fails. So no, it cannot currently Perfect. summon. I'm going to move there and do an attack two. Okay. It's got shield one. And uh, I guess I don't need to use my pocket sand because pocket sand. his turn will be negated. 
Uh, it's three attack. So two damage. Two damage. Okay. Um, and then I will be using the heal for this to alleviate this. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. And then I will be using my health potion to regain three health. Nice. And now I'm at five health. Oh, much better. <laughs> I think we may have, oh, I may have lost. You can do it. Okay. I believe in you. Do the thing. Experience. Uh, first of all, our shaman. Mm -hmm. So no shaman. Shaman's dead. Two remaining shaman. This one moves one, two. And then this one. Uh, oh, shit. This one heals. This. It heals this uh, living corpse. And then this one heals the ooze you just damaged. <laughs> yeah, whatever. Okay. Right. Uh, and then it's Jacob. Yeah. Alright. One, two, three, four. Um, I declare it's down four. Actually, one second. Uh, before I do that, I'm going to do this attack. Hmm, smart. Yeah. I'm supposed to shuffle this. Are you going to do it against the Drake or with disadvantage? I against... have two targets. Okay. I'm just joining up experience regardless of if you win or lose. Yep. Yeah. I mean, that's the thing to do at this point. Unfortunately, because I have to do so much like movement stuff, I haven't been able to. How much health does the Burnling Scout have? Three. Okay. There's that's a chance. Not a lot. If I can kill the Vermling Scout, I will be okay. I think. Alright. I'm going to start with the drip. Okay. So he just has an attack of two coming in at him. One. Okay. Alright. One damage. One damage. It's fine. Vermling Scout, I have disadvantage. So plus one. Plus zero. He has two health. That's two health for two, No, he, he takes two damage. That's one health for that's number nine. Number nine. That sucks. Ah, Alright. One, two, three, four. If I was able to kill him, I would have been able to do stuff. Or probably would have survived. Now I'm not so sure. Alright. Okay. Oh, ten must have died. Okay. Uh, cool. that's um, okay, so the scouts go first. My scout, and then this one, and then so, um, one, two, three, four, five. One, two, three. That's as close as you can get. Loser! <laughs> um, I guess it doesn't really matter, but. Um, and then. One, two, three. Alright, Jacob, you have an incoming strength one attack. Mm -hmm. Plus one for poison is two. One. Okay. Mm -hmm. One health left. Yep. Okay. Uh, okay, so that's scouts. Next is 66, the living corpses. Can't move. Move. is Drake. Drake's move two. So starting with yours. One, two. One, two. One, two. This one can actually reach me with an attack. Okay. So it will make a strength one attack. Mm -hmm. Two damage. Uh, I will negate that incoming damage. With a, um, oh, this is literally not going to matter. These two. I am one card off. And I made a very stupid mistake early on. Uh, okay, so that's that. that. Uh, next and last is the oozes. They take two damage each. 
and attempt to bubble over. And the only one that is able to successfully do so is the Elite, which bubbles over, producing a 7 health normal use. So, uh, I am in a short rest. Me too. Wait. <laughs> Lost Trickster's Reversal, but it doesn't matter because I exhausted the beginning of the round. Uh, God damn it. I'm literally one card short. You don't have uh, movement on the top? No. Because I fucking, I, I actually accidentally threw out my loot card earlier, or I would have been able to end it this right now. That was very silly. It was. It was dumb of me. Extremely dumb of me. You, I realized those, those are your last two cards, right? Yes. Yeah. Mm-hmm. All right, these shuffle. In that case, I'm going to get as much experience as I can. A scenario immediately ends after you exhaust, right? Yes. Because uh, we lose a scenario when... <laughs> yes. Yes. You Just make sure that you mm-hmm. don't die. Oh, I'm not. I'm, I'm okay. exhausting. Okay. Uh, because I'm summoning my decoy so right. that I don't die. <laughs> <laughs> if you move faster than the scout. Yes. Which I don't know if I do. Be at least turning up some experience on this round. I'm exhausted. So. Yeah. All right. Okay. So, reveal people. I go at 15. Okay. Jacob, you're at 34, I assume. Living Corpse is at 91. Scouts at 53. 53, okay. And Shamans at 9. And then Living Drakes. I assume right. this is early enough that we can do it again. All right. Cool. What time is it? It's 9.30. 30. With everything set up, we can probably... Yeah, we can go again. Mm-hmm. In this separate right. scenario. So, who goes first? Uh, I'm at 15. Go for it. Uh, Shamans go first. Oh, Shamans. Uh, move. They don't have to move. Well, this one does. Mm-hmm. Uh, one, two, three. And then this one doesn't move. It makes a straight zero attack. Zero damage, but you are cursed. Okay. Mm-hmm. Take a random curse card. Um, with 15, I'm going to... Uh, here's the reason I've got to shuffle in. Because I'm doing a fucked up damage. Yeah. Um, so I'm going to use my trample ability to move four, going at one, two, three, four. Okay. Um, dealing two damage, or attack two to every enemy I moved through. Okay. Mm-hmm. So we'll do it in the order of the people I moved through. So attacking ooze eight. It's a curse. Okay. It's bound to have one of those. Uh, shaman five. Uh, Shaman 5 has a 3 damage. Okay, but it has shield 3. Perfect. Fantastic. <laughs> um, and then the warrior, or scout, it's just 3 damage. It's dead. Oh, uh, no, that's an elite scout, but it already had damage on it. It's dead. It's dead. Okay. Um, well, then I don't get to do the super cool thing, which was to use my battle axe on this attack anyways. But uh, I will go and make an attack 4 with stun on the Shaman. Okay. Does five damage. I hate that the, the looting rules are different with this one. Because that also prevents me from winning. Um, five damage onto the shaman that's stunned, sure but I don't I know. Yeah. I don't know if that matters. Uh, who stunned the uh, shaman? Okay. Stunned and took five damage, whatever shield mitigated at five. Okay. Shield mitigated three, it has one health remaining. Okay. That's a shame. It is stunned, though. And at the very least, I gain four experience for that. Okay. And then uh, Jacob. Summon. Yep. And so I gain two. And then one, two. Okay. Um, I don't think we need to play out the rest of the round. Uh, Technically, I think I would take a four. Uh, Well, I would only take damage from... We probably still have to do some damage, though. Yeah. Just in uh, case I this one dies or something and, like weird happens that that like it still matters to kill me. Uh, scout. Uh, 
Because if I take any damage right now, uh, I actually die. Scout makes a strength two attack against this summon. Three. Okay. I'm going to bathroom. Mm -hmm. If I do take damage for whatever reason, just burn those. Okay. That's the only scout left on the board. All right. Uh, spitting Drake. Yep. Yeah, spitting Drake moves one, two, three. And makes a strength two attack against the decoy. Four. Okay, decoy is done. Okay. And then Living Corpse moves here, here. They yep. deal one damage to themselves, we're done. Cool. Alright. Okay, well okay. that's awesome. So go ahead and if you looted coins, get your coins. If you gained experience, gain your experience. Mm -hmm. You do not get your check marks. Yeah. So the, the reason that I laughed at the very beginning, my check mark was reveal a room tile by opening a door on your turn during a scenario. Okay. Yeah, that's why I was laughing. I was just like, you know, that's literally what the scenario is. <laughs> uh, each coin is worth three gold. Okay, so I got three gold. What do you fucking do? I assume we're just going to do the thing where we immediately reattempt the scenario. Yes, I believe so. All right. Dun, 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 dun. Get all this back. I'm going to change some shit because I made some mistakes. Mistakes were made. Uh, do okay. So here's the thing. Mm -hmm. We don't have to do a road event because we can just do the same scenario again yeah. immediately. Mm -hmm. But technically, we don't have to do a road event because we're linked to Gloomhaven. Haven. Do we want to go back and do another city event? Yeah. I'd like to do another city event, yes. Yes. Uh, how much was each coin? Three. 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 Okay. 21 monies. All right, take them if you want to grab the deck of city events. Uh, I think I will actually... You know what? Just for the hell of it, I'm going to bless at the tree. Of Whoa. The hey, big spender. Because at this point, looking through all of that stuff, there's not that much that I can... Yeah. Get at this current prosperity level. <laughs> <laughs> Alright. Who wants to read one? Oh, me. I never get to read. Yeah, you don't. You're always holding the curse. For sure. Sure. My curses. Alright. I'll keep two curses and get rid of the rest. After a night of heavy drinking, you get turned around while navigating the back alleys and find yourself standing before a collapsed section of bricked road that leads down into an underground tunnel. Mm -hmm. Fueled by curiosity and a bit of liquid courage, you descend in search of adventure. Stumbling around in the vast network of tunnels proves rather fruitless, however, until a well-concealed passage leads you to a long-forgotten stash of weaponry and dried food. Okay. The stuff could fetch a decent price at the sunken market, or you could turn it over to the city guard, which is always in need of arms and rations. Uh, Selling sell it. it. Yep. <laughs> All right. Uh, uh, using a few less than savory contacts, you're able to mm -hmm. unload the goods for a respectable price. Who knew drunken strolls could prove so profitable? Ten gold each. Oh, thank God. Uh, if our reputation was g less than negative nine, we would have gained an additional five gold each. But <laughs> that wasn't something we were even close to. Nope. A rip up. Actually, that allows me to buy a cloak of invisibility. Nice. nice. I'm up to twenty-one gold. Which I am going to do because it seems that I need it. Well, honestly, do you want to? Oh, you already have the issue. Yeah. <laughs> I used them at the very beginning and in order to do Yeah, to cool hurt shit. all the front right. group of enemies. Yeah. So get your shit off my board. Uh, do we want to do the same dungeons? This is actually exactly the question I was going to ask. Because the problem for y'all is because I can get over those oozes no problem. And I think if they multiply... We would have won off. had I not made one tactical mistake. Okay, so okay. we're good to keep it? Yeah. Yeah. Oh. Yeah, because I, I literally like I, I had one tactical mistake that I that I made that right. that cost us the game. The game. Yeah. Because I had no problem. Um, yeah. I. I and or did, there was, was two mistakes that I made that that cost me the game. But but e either way, like yeah. I I know what those were. Yeah. Those oozes could really be a problem for someone who can't jump over them. Yeah. Because especially if they're you know freaking free, draw all the time. You know I'm just. Okay, uh, and we gain the experience, but no bonus experience, right? Correct. So, seven experience. Just had the pencil. Sorry. Damn. 
I'm at 121 experience out of 150 for level 4. Nice. nice. Uh, William, you said you blessed? Yes. Don't forget to also remove your most of your curses. Yeah, I still have two curses in my deck. The yes. rest are gone. Good. I would also like a bless wherever those cards are. Yep. Is that over there? Mm -hmm. Here. How many of them you get? Uh, just one, I believe. Right. For yeah, a, just, one. just one? Okay. All right. We're 60% uh, of the way to opening envelope B. Hmm. Okay. All righty then. Um, oh, uh, we got new ones of these? Yes, that's correct. Mine was end the scenario with two or less health. Which, <laughs> yeah, that wasn't any problem. Nope. Mine was, part of the uh, thing, part of the reason this is so fucking devastating is because we have so many things that can poison. Yeah. Always it's it's just real pain. ball breaking. Alright. If you could set up everything, Greg, on the monster side. Yeah, I'm working on it. Point, point. Tight your chest. This may as well keep the ones that are up everything on stands. True, I didn't think about that. Yeah. What's coming? That would have been clever. Health and experience. Uh, don't forget to put your chests back. Your money. I'm yeah. probably going to be doing the exact same opening okay. structure. It worked well. <laughs> Both of these suck. <laughs> Invisibility means that they don't. They don't target you. They don't target you. Cool. In fact, you cannot cool. be targeted. Cool. See, the thing is, I never get the kill five monsters during the scenario. <laughs> nope. I never get those. I get the stupid ones. <laughs> I don't know if there is one that's that straightforward, to be honest with you. I think there is. Or there's like, kill a monster in a single hit. Mm -hmm. Yeah, that exists. Or overkill, which granted I got last time. but Alright, well. we're gonna try again. Yes, we can we're do it this time. We're gonna get another shot. Yep. Alright. Alright, you go to the place, there's an arch, you do the, the Mount Haven. Yep, exactly. Uh, let's see, let's see. What, I need to get rid of one card, sorry. Yes. And yeah. oh, so it is. Nice. Okay. Zoop. Shit. Already. I'm going to use this. Get that back. Gain all these back. And this. Okay. <coughs> yes. Yep. Uh-huh. Mm -hmm. Okay. Cool. Alrighty. Uh, everyone... Oh, you're a cool. Yeah, I think based on all this, if you need to switch out cards... I did. Oh. <laughs> Alright. Everybody good? Yep. yep. 16. 27. 19. Oh, 16. Shaman at 89, Scouts at 40, Corpses at 71. Cool. Hmm. I'm leading with the poison, because why not? Yep. Alright. 16, who's going first? You're, go you're going first, 6? 16. Oh, you're going 16. Alright, uh, so I'm going first. That's what that means. Cool. I am using my winged boots. Moving corpses of movement, don't they? So I go I 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. Oh, shit! <laughs> <laughs> yes, yes you do. <laughs> okay, so you're not messing around. No, no I'm not. I learned my lesson <laughs> by barely escaping with my own nose intact last time. <laughs> so where do people spawn here? If you would, Greg. That's hilarious. Here. Okay. Well, technically, okay. So that was one, two, three. Here. Here. And 
Okay. So yeah, four, five, six. I'm gonna go here, um, and then I am going to. Is it, what's the Drake? Oh, oh yeah, one, two, one. Eighty-nine, very late. And he's doing okay. the range. He can actually hit you. This time. Yeah. There's not much I can do about that one. And then what's the scout doing? Not a ranged attack. Not a ranged attack. Okay, cool. So I am going to. Yeah. I'm going to throw a net at a scout. That's what I'm going to do. Um, so that gives me a, an attack of that's a three. Four and a wound. Oh, so this was before you moved. Four and a wound? The, the scout oh. is dead. Oh, shoot. Dang, oh. Nice. You'd be dead. Wait, that was an elite. Oh, no. no that was a base. regular scout. Nice. Cool. He's nice. dead. Ooh, Wait, wasn't there supposed to be another Drake there? Weren't you fighting? No, I only had one. Drake. Oh, you were fighting Drake Drake. Right. Yeah. Someone was fighting Drake Drake. Okay, cool. That's that's what I got. That's what I did. Okay. All right. So that was uh, sixteen. So mm -hmm. next. Twenty-seven. Is Twenty-seven. Yes. Okay. So I'll be going one, two. Open the door. See where the oozes go. Great. Using jump. Single elite ooze here. A single elite scout here. And a single non elite shaman here. Okay. Mm -hmm. boop, boop. Uh, scout does what? Move one, attack minus one. Ooze does what? Uh, who's does move and attack? Move plus one, attack minus one. Okay, yeah, I'm trying to almost certain what I'm doing right here. I'm gonna move right here so that I am out of range of the living corpse when he moves into attack, I believe. Yeah. Yeah, perfect. Um, and then I'm going to spare deck. Okay. okay. Three damage. Three okay. damage. Uh, yeah, he's the only one I can hit. Three damage. Okay. One, two, three, to number one. Right. And I will pop my minor stamina potion. Mm -hmm. Oh, uh, technically it was regardless. One, two, three, four, five. Yeah. No, I couldn't have made that attack then. Yeah. I wouldn't have attacked. So I've just moved out of the way as far as I could have. Okay. So I mean, so there's no damage on this. No part. damage on that guy. I reduced my experience by one. Mm -hmm. Should have calculated that better. Oh well. No weapons. All right. Uh, next is and I pop a stand amount of potion. The ooze. Dude. Followed by the scouts. So elite scouts. There is this one. Who moves? One, two. Three, four, five. Bam. And this one moves one, two, three, four. Mm -hmm. And makes a strength two, two attack. Okay, that's fine. Yeah. Comparatively reasonable. Comparatively reasonable compared uh, to what I have. Not elite said. scouts. We've got number six who moves one, two, three, four. Mm -hmm. Number seven who moves one, two, three and makes a strength one, one attack against Will. Attack it. And number nine, who moves and makes a strength one, zero attack against me. Nice. All right. Okay, that is the scouts. Mm -hmm. Next is me at 60. Um, All right. This is not how I wanted this to go. Not ideal. I'm having another piece of cake because it was delicious. I just want more cake. Okay, we always have an unexpected loss against the Titans. We bounce back, we adjust our strategy. It all works Sports out. Sports ball. <laughs> Mr. Sports ball. I'm gonna also I'm gonna try and bold strategy, Cotton. I hope it pays off for it. Go for it. It's a bold move, Cotton! Venom shiv. Okay. Winged shoes. Like, yep. 
One, two, three, four, five. Okay. Uh, lands me adjacent to an elite scout. Mm -hmm. With winged boys down range. Okay. Uh, and then uh, I will use quick hands to stab him. Stab it. Uh, so strength two. Uh, yeah, strength two. Four. Don't mind if I do. Sadly, that is not enough to kill him. <laughs> not. He's got one health left. But he already moved. Oh no, he no, moved. he moved back to us now. Uh, okay, so that's my turn, which yep. means now. The shit that I spawned gets to move. So this guy doesn't move at all. He makes a strength two, three attack. I mean, barely. Look at that. Uh, okay, and then the living corpses. So move, 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 move. Mm -hmm. And then finally the spinning drakes. So, my spitting drake moves first. Others are generated, not that it matters. One, two. And then uh, your spitting drake doesn't move at all and mm -hmm. makes an attack. Yep. So, this is a one strength one. one attack that will muddle and poison. Muddle and poison. So, yeah. you have taken one damage and a muddle and poison. Yeah. Uh, and then number six moves one, two. Okay. Cool. Uh, and that is the round. That's all she <coughs> Thank you. All right. Well, we're certainly off to a different start. Yes. I, will re I will reserve judgment about whether it is a stronger start. Mm-hmm. I think I'm going to do these two. Beautiful, perfect, exactly what I wanted. You Thanks. know what's in your hand. <laughs> well, I didn't. Is Wait. the thing. Oh. I didn't know if I had a card uh, with these specific shit. effects that I wanted. I forgot to have the shaman move. Uh, mm. They move last. Um, this guy. Wait, are there any elite shaman moves? No. No. There are three regular shaman. Mm -hmm. Two, three, and five. So. Oh, this motherfucker may not screw this up. One. Oh, he only moves one. Uh, oh, all, it only affects adjacent allies. So, boop, and that's it. Um, uh, right. technically, he oh, doesn't yeah. move. Okay. Uh, if they don't have an attack, they move as though mm -hmm. they move as though they had an attack uh, range zero. Cool. Uh, like a melee attack. Uh, and then, can I get one additional bless card, please? Mm -hmm. Okay. Cool. So, I'm going to do this. Do, do. Not this turn, but next turn, and we'll get just. Thing. Uh, yeah, I'm not entirely sure what it. You will. We'll find a way. I will get it. Yeah. It's just a matter of what. Let's see. So, they have that much help, that much help. All right. <coughs> Like how that's gonna go. Literally, there's only one way if you get screwed over on this. Don't say that. <laughs> so <I decided laughs> because it's going to be that one, one way. I mean, still, like I've got the first. I got enough cards here that I'll be fine. That's what I thought. I had twelve cards. <laughs> well, I've got you know movement six. <laughs> True. You you can get the places. You are good at getting. 
I can, I can sprint if we need it. Yeah. Alrighty. Okay, we got movement Thanks. six and about three movement fours. Going at 20? 10. 32. Cool. They're going at Shaman's at 23, Scout's at 29, uh, Living Corpse is at 66, and an 85. And, uh, did you already flip both? I did. Okay. okay. They're doing a lot of special shit. Yep. Okay. Uh, me first, and then you, and then uh, then the shamans, and then the, the scouts go before me. Yep. yep. Okay. Uh, All right. So throwing knives. Okay. Uh, targeting this guy. So attack strength two with disadvantage. No, that's their deck. What am I doing? One damage is enough to kill him. He is dead. Oop. And then strength two, not with disadvantage. But it's not. Cool. I'm glad I actually didn't run into that yeah. against the other guy. Because yeah. that would have been just ball breaking. Cool. Alrighty. Interesting. My turn? Uh, no, and then I use uh, swift bow to move one, two, picking this up along the way. Cool. Done. Alright. I am going to summon my decoy. And the decoy is going to go right here. And I'm going to go one, two, three, four. Nice. Yep. <laughs> I am not taking attacks. <laughs> uh, I'm going to use my minor stamina potion on my turn to reclaim Venom Shiv. <laughs> I uh, other people go first, right? Uh, we've got these two going before you. Okay. All right. So first up is the shaman. Uh, no one in this shaman's line of sight is injured. So uh, move. I'll be right back. Move. No one in this shaman's line of sight is injured. So move. Move. This dude is a dick. He did the one thing that was gonna screw me over. No. <laughs> This shaman is going to Told you. Uh, okay. That's the shaman, and then the scouts. So, elite scouts, starting with number two. Uh, one. And then it takes a strength two attack against the decoy. Decoy takes four damage. Elite number eight doesn't have to move. Makes a strength two. Ooh, four more damage. Jacob, how much health does your decoy have? Six. It's dead. Okay. Well, I use both bless. Uh, there's one more. Because there's three shots. Right. Um. And then this elite scout moves here and makes a strength two. Four. They used all their attack. They used all their bless, yeah. Makes a strength four attacking. I'll attack it. Okay. Uh, and then non elites. I'm gonna do something stupid. That's gonna be fun. Non elites. This one over here moves one, two. This one moves one, two. Alright. Okay. You're up. That dude is ass half that shaman. How much damage is the trap? Uh, the trap is four. Four damage. Okay. Yep. One, two, three. Okay, you're just gonna eat it. No, I'm gonna discard. Got to burn all what all my attacks are, actually. Uh yeah. Discard this or lose that. Do not take damage from that. Then I'm going to attack three, push two onto the slime. Okay. So strength three attack. Crit. Nice. Six minus one for the shield is five damage. Nice. That's half its health. Yep. And it's pushed back. <clears throat> nice. Solid impact. 
also means any subsequent uh, slimes it creates are will be at three. Did I take any damage? Yes. Uh, you did not take any cool. damage. Your decoy took an eight. That's fine. Uh, okay. it, it, it served You're its purpose. Done? Yes. Okay. Uh, fifty-seven for the spitting drakes. Uh, spitting drake number four takes a swoop back and breath weapons at me for strength two, three, uh, that's going to muddle me, and I'm going to force it to be disadvantage. No muddle ones. ends at the end of your next... Yes, at the end of your next activation. Activation. Um, okay, so that's that, and then Drake number five doesn't have to move, it's going to attack you. Yep. Two, one damage and muddled. Okay, so two damage. And then this guy is going to move here and make an attack from there. So two, one damage. And I am still as muddled as ever. My plan will take a slight detour. <laughs> but I will still be doing fine. All right, cool. Instead of this turn getting it, I will get it next turn. Unless this dude wants to be a dick. Well, he does. Um, sure, that's, he his, does. that's his point. The ooze is the no. Sorry, living corpses. Uh, move, move, can't move. Uh, that's it. Uh, the ooze is not moving and out of range. Yep. Okay. That's why I pushed him back. Smart. Alright. Everybody good? Alright. Yep. yep. Oh, wait, hang on. Shuffle. Well, technically, shuffle. I was going to push him back in. Shuffle. shuffle. Oh, I shuffle. I was going to. A shuffle. Okay. A lot of shuffling going on. This cool. you got a pencil. Yes. Okay. Mm -hmm. okay. All right. Twenty three. Eighteen. Thirty four. Jacob, can you shuffle the living corpses sure. and or the drinks? Yep. Technically, drank my health potion at the end of my turn. My bad. Right. I'm at ten health. Oh, and you're still Yeah, all right. Okay. Um. All right. Cool. Eighteen. Mm-hmm. Eighteen. Thirty-four. Cool. So I am going to first um, at range. Yeah, he's he's in this square, right? Mm-hmm. Cool. I'm attack the Drake. Okay. Um, and so I have muddle, so I'm at disadvantage. To the negative one or plus zero, so he takes one damage, but is poisoned. Okay. And then I am going to loot, and I am going to take all of this shit, nice, nice. including this. That feels pretty good. Yep. Nice. Um, um, and oh. cloak of invisibility. Hmm. Smart. Next up is me. I'm going to use Thieves in the Air, uh, Special Mixture to go one, two, three, and Poison Drake number six. Mm -hmm. And then I'm going to use Thieves Neck to disarm this trap. Cool. Which I may or may not live to regret, but it does give me two experience. So. It should be fine. That's me. Okay. Does anyone have under 34 for the baddies? Uh, the Spitting Drakes do. Spitting Drakes do. Okay. So, Spitting Drakes. Number five, I think. Four, or four goes was. first. It can attack me from where it is. Yeah. Strength two. Mm -hmm. Two. I'll eat it. Yep. Uh, Drake five. Strength two. Ah, I'm invisible. You're invisible. Drake six. No. Well, what does it do now? Nothing. It, it can't it target it, any other it enemy. It can't target okay. any enemy. So, uh, but 
it doesn't have like a default movement towards something. No. Yeah. I it it would move towards the most targetable opponent, but there are no because of this. This is what's preventing any behavior. All right. Normally, it would move towards one of us, no yeah, matter how far away we are. Oh, yeah. uh, Drake six, strength two, three. Nope, not gonna eat that. That would kill me. Oh, and I'm no longer muddled. Uh, but I am muddled because the Drake hit me. Mm -hmm. Um. What do? What do you do? Who do you who do? I'm done. I'm sorry. Um. You're gonna sing aloud. In the words of Blazing Saddles. Now go do <laughs> that, that voodoo, voodoo that you do so well. well. <laughs> that might have been the first time Jacob and I connected on movie reference. <laughs> If, if it's Mel Brooks, there's a decent chance Jake will actually get him. Yep. yep. Uh, yeah, okay, so that's Drake's. Next up is Willie. <laughs> One, two, fuck you. Okay. <laughs> One, two, no fuck damage. do. No damage. Fantastically. Yeah. Fantastic damage. I'm an idiot. I didn't mix all those cards in after the last round. Whatever. Mm -hmm. Moving along. Four. One, two, three, four. Cool. That's my turn. Okay, cool. Uh, 66. <laughs> Idiot. Uh, Sorry, that was to me. Living corpses okay. can't move except for this one. That's it. Yep. Uh, ooze. Move. Minus one, so it doesn't move. Okay. Uh, it loots, but it can't loot, and it heals itself for two. All right. Okay. Uh, next. next is scouts. Mm -hmm. So scouts none of starting these. with uh, <laughs> all right, guys, none of them uh, do shit. Yeah, I'm starting with this elite then. Uh, move minus one, so one, two, three, and that's it. Starting with. This non elite. One, two. That's it. Starting with this guy. One, two. Oh, shit. He actually gets in the there. A queen. Uh, strength three. Three. I do have to lose a thing, though. That's balls. Um, I will lose Trickster's Reversal, which feels bad, but what are you going to do? Lose Trickster's Reversal, I guess. Yeah. Um,. Cool, that is Scouts at 69, and then Anchor on the Track is Shaman at 89. Mm -hmm. Shaman, uh, move, heal, oh wait, they probably moved to maximize their heal. Don't th didn't you say that they always move to maximize, or to get in range? I did say that. Yeah, they should do that. <laughs> not because I have anything to gain by it. No, no, of course. Well, of course not, yeah. I didn't do that. I would never do that. No. Dang on. Having abilities other than attack does not affect the monster's movement in any way. Adjacent allies, but there are none, and then blesses. We're gonna get three of these again. Okay. Yeah, that's fine. Well, it's fine for me. Okay. Um, and then let's see. That one can't target, so another thing in its chamber is healed, and then there's no other. Oh, this one technically. Uh, one, two, and then that's it. Cool. No, wait. Sorry. One, and that's it. Okay. Um, okay. Top of the round. Cool. Hey. Ready to go. I'm not going to use this. I'm going to use this. And currently, like, my, my MO oh, is gonna... going to be to exhaust as quick as possible so I don't die. Right. I'm short resting. We're just gonna shit up. Oh well, you get experience by losing cards. Yeah, exactly. Yeah, okay, but that. Hopefully. It's not that big. Mm -hmm. uh, okay, so I'm going to use these two abilities. Alright. 
I'm good. Everybody okay. good? Yep. Okay. 12. 66. 15. Uh, invisibility goes after the end of my next turn, right? Correct. Cool. That's good. That's what I like to hear. Six. Literally my latest card. Uh, this is going to split. This is going to ooze. Okay. Uh, All right. So it's me. Yep. Whoosh. I'm invisible. Nice. One, two, three. If it's a tie between me and the living corpse. You get to decide. Yes, I get to decide. Cool. That's correct. Nice. I get to go after every single one of my Fifteen. Things. Fifteen. Uh, so I'm going to use the bottom action here. Okay. To grab all this crap. Nice. Nice. Sure. Um. I'll be ending the game next round. Awesome. Okay. And then I'm going to spare dagger onto that dude. No, wait, no, no. Spare dagger onto Oozman. 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 <laughs> that was a thing we just did. <laughs> Plus I mean, zero, so it's three awesome. damage minus two. Uh, no, three damage minus one. Three damage minus one. What's next? Experience. Uh, that's my turn. Okay. Cool. Uh, then 23. I looted and I attack. Yes, 23. So the shaman, heal again. Okay. Of every bitch. Um, <laughs> oop. And, yeah. Okay. Nothing. Uh, but they do heal. Uh, nothing in your room nothing, is damaged. Yeah, literally nothing cool. happens in my room. there's no shaman, and then... I have gone invisible, and they don't know anything, and they don't feel anything. And cool. All right, that's 23. Next is 35. So, uh, I am also invisible. So, none of our shit does yeah. shit. Invisibility is pretty damn good. Uh, this guy... Oh, here they are. Move. Boop, boop. One, two, three, four. So all the further it needs to go. Mm -hmm. And then one, two, three. Uh, how do you go through the obstacle? They have jump this time, I just realized. Oh, okay. But that's all the closer it can get. Yeah. That's all that they do. Next is 57. Spitting drakes are only in the chambers with the invisible people. Mm -hmm. Living corpses. This guy finally gets to move. This guy finally gets to move. No, he doesn't move. Right, because he can't actually target. These guys don't move because they can't target. They finally are able to move, and they don't. Yep. <laughs> oh, troll. Um, and then you go. And then me. And then cool. the will split. So I'll take care of that now. You can do your shit. Mm -hmm. All right. I am going to... Yeah. Uh, how much health does a spinning drake have? He has full health, right? Yeah. Oh, he, no, no, he got he's healed. the one that's taking one damage. He got, he got healed by the shaman. Yes. Which just, just works. Works. Yes. Uh, how much I thought does that was the normal ooze now? Seven. And a full seven? Yeah. yeah. Even after all the damage? Yeah, because the shaman with the healing. All right. All right. I'm going to use my eagle eye goggles. Okay. On uh, attack of six at range five against this drake. Okay. Fuck it up. Yep. All right. Overkill. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> that's, that's one of those best case scenarios. That is one of those, like... It takes advantage. 10 damage. Which means... No! It's a strength 6 attack? Yeah, it, it takes, takes 12. 12 damage. Wow. And it already had 1, which meant you overkilled it by 5. I forget what yeah. your target is. If you have... I, I didn't... I didn't oh, okay, you were just referring to it. That was my I was just saying thing. because, like, it was... It's pretty much... A, I completely destroyed it. Yeah. Um, and then I'm gonna heal myself to get rid of my poison. Yeah, as one does. Um... Right, and then I get to lose both of these cards. Yep. You said you're ending the game this round? Yeah. Alright. Well. I'm good to go then. Let's see. What am I going to do? I'm going to do this and... I mean, we still have to survive the round, so don't be completely careless. Yeah. I mean, you have to survive the round. Uh... If you sure. win, that's right. That's a good point. Uh, Jacob, can you help me shuffle? Or if no, Will, can you help me shuffle with Jacob's still? Yeah, sure. Which ones? Um, all sure. of them, actually. And Jacob, don't forget to shuffle your damage deck. Yep. Okay. 
Right, I'm just gonna see how much of a dick I can be. I'm growing light. I'm just going pretty light too. I'm going like middle, <laughs> early, early middle, which is as late as I'm really <laughs> capable of going at the moment. I mean, I'm going yeah middle, but that works. Good. I'm glad we got to do this twice. <laughs> yeah, me too. Polish it off and not have to. Because otherwise, we'd have to like reset it up and then come yeah, back right. and be like, wait, how did this not work? This was a good choice. Yeah. This makes and sense. we're probably gonna be done about the time we finish normal. So actually, yeah. yeah. Uh, okay. Cool. Okay. You're going at forty-seven. Thirty-seven. Going, going at sixty-one. Double check. Cool. All right. Shaman at eight. Sixty-one. Jesus. Fifty-four. Twenty-one. Okay. William, I have bad news. What? You're being disarmed. Dick. <laughs> <laughs> uh, okay. So. Shaman activate first. This particular shaman makes an attack against you with disadvantage. So, uh, zero. Zero. Dick! Oh, you are still disarmed. <laughs> <laughs> uh, no. You're not invisible anymore, right? No. Zero. <laughs> zero! <laughs> <laughs> zero times two is still zero! But you are also disarmed. Uh, what does that mean again? It means you can't make an attack. Okay. I still get the experience. Dick! <laughs> uh, Twenty-one. Exact. Will be Did you go at eighteen or forty-seven? Forty-seven. Okay. Sixty-one. Uh, so yeah, twenty-one. Okay. So uh, boop boop. Mm-hmm. I'm still invisible. Boop boop. Cool. Uh, next up is twenty-seven. Mm-hmm. Spinning drakes. Uh, attack. Oh, there's no drake there anymore, yep. and I'm invisible. Uh, so now it's me at 36. Yep. Okay. 61. Uh, so I'm going to use uh, throwing knives to loot everything in range 2. Triggering the end of the game. Mm-hmm. And then I'm going to use swift bow to attack this firmling. Okay. Uh, for Three, four, eight damage. <laughs> Dang. Because I revealed myself with my invisibility by making that attack and fucking obliterating that mm-hmm. Okay, uh, And that is me at 36, mm-hmm. which means next is... Me at 47. Oh. You at 47, yes. Mm. Well... I do fuckle. I add, I have a shield. That's it. Cool. Yeah, shield it. Mm-hmm. Uh, next is scouts at 54. I rearm myself. Scouts at 54. No scouts. Scouts. Mm-hmm. They do have a range 3 attack. So, mm-hmm. uh, 1, 2. Can't reach. 1, 2. Can reach. Can reach. Strength 3. Two, you're poisoned. Okay, so one damage and I'm poisoned. Yes, right, because of shield. Uh, and then this guy has nowhere to back up to, mm-hmm. so he just takes an attack with disadvantage against you. Uh, one damage. Yeah. Uh, sorry, two damage. Two damage and you're poisoned. And poisoned. Yeah, so uh, This guy, one plus one, three damage. To me? And okay. then that guy needs one and can't reach. Mm-hmm. Okay. Uh, and then Ooze. Can't okay. do shit. Uh, they have a range attack. Oh. So uh, strength three plus one is four, mm-hmm. five. We're discarding. Uh, we're ending this game or this yeah. turn, right? Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Uh, and then strength two plus one is three, three. Uh, for my stuff, not sure. Okay, so let me see if I can get the experience from this. Yeah. I'd like to use trample, move four, jumping, attack two, to all targets targeted through, and gain two experience. It cannot perform any attack abilities. But do I still get the. No. I think that that means that I you think just... we kind of determined that, like, if you can't actually, like, you can't just attack the empty air. Yeah. Like, but I'm, just... s- I'm still mo- doing the move action. Right. 
Right. That that is, I think, this is one of those weird corner cases where like, it might work. I'm using the card's ability to the. I, it's not yeah. that I'm just using it. No, no, I'm no I know. Using but it with but I think that you have to use the full thing. Gaining experience. Some actions also have an experience value attached to them denoted by a star when that action is taken. So, yes, you okay. can gain experience. Just because the movie? a card is divided into top and bottom actions. Mm -hmm. Actions can be further subdivided into abilities. So the bottom action on the trample card has a move ability and an attack ability. Okay. But the plus two experience is attached to the action, which is the entire bottom half of the card. Because so I would still get the experience if I was just trampling to move distance, mm -hmm. even if I didn't attack. Right. True. So one, two, three, four. It's going to suck, right? Because then I was getting you with overwhelming assault with a battle axe. Nah, that would have been Well, gain your um, two experience. Gain your two experience. And I can't gain this experience. No. No. Correct, because you can't actually use that ability. That's fine. I still level up. That's the important part. Yep. All right. That's it, right? Yeah, that's it. Cool. All right, so. Cool. All right, so. Uh, gain yon shit. Gold uh, is worth three gold each. Gold is worth three each. Six coins. So I'm up to 25. Oh, wait, shit. I should read off the uh, fancy stuff. Yep. All right. Uh, conclusion. Inside the chests, you find the pieces to a gruesome staff adorned in maggots with a decayed skull in it. When you grab the last piece, another set of hidden doors I lose the mission behind the chests. <laughs> Judging that you have no choice but to take this new route, you enter. After a while, you come upon an intersection of five paths where you rejoin your party and follow the final path back up to the surface. You return to your quarters and piece together the fragments of the stack. Despite its fearsome appearance, you cannot discern its function. You do, however, notice some carving. Deciphering them with the help of the tome, you find instructions to enter a secret room in one of the crypts you have previously searched. Mm. You have your next destination. Cool. Right. Awesome. So we reveal new location 53, the crypt basement. Uh, and then... yeah. uh, how much experience do we get for this? Uh, we get 8 experience in addition to whatever we earned. So I get 13 total, bringing me up to 100, and I am now level 3. I'm at 98, and also level 3. I looted a treasure overlay pot earlier, so I'll get a check mark. So I get another perk. I gained 7 or fewer experience points during the scenario, so I gained 2 check marks, gaining a second perk for check marks, and a third perk, or so rather, a third perk for mm -hmm. check marks, and a fourth perk for leveling up. Cool. I. Surprisingly enough, did not kill a single enemy in this encounter. Wow. The maximum was yeah. three that I could have killed. I probably would have killed two on that turn if I yeah. could have. Um, That's which impressive. would have got me just under the mark. But yeah. uh, I successfully somehow did pass on this. Yeah, that's surprising. <laughs> that is very surprising. All right. Well, uh, I believe that that's uh, all we got for the stream today. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, the rest of our stuff we can do off stream because there's yeah. no real it's point. Leveling. There's uh, leveling up and that kind of stuff. No prosperity. No other cool shit. So, um, everyone who has joined in, thank you very much for for coming by again. Thanks to uh, Irish Ramsey, uh, Amanda, for the cake, which is uh, amazing and delicious. Yes, it's and good. Thank you. I'm gonna eat more of it off stream. Yeah. So, uh, thank you very much. And um, yeah. We will see you guys on Wednesday for Near and Far, and then uh, Friday from, for another Gloomhaven. So, uh, have a good night, everyone. Bye.